Hello, and welcome back to our Seven Days to Die Let's Play Poorly. When last we were here, we had managed to slink our way back in the middle of the dark of night, back home, with a whole bunch of loot. We got a bit of food here we need to eat. Drink some water. How are we doing here? We've got... Okay, we're going to split our brass in half so that it goes double fast until we figure out what else we're going to put in there. These are in good shape here. What I should probably start doing in the middle of the night here is I should start putting together my uh, my storage tables, my storage boxes separate um, separated out by type. Um, so I've th I think I've made the decision that I'm going to actually just keep this little house and uh, and just work on uh, building it out um, and uh, reinforcing it and so on. So we're going to need some nails. We're going to need iron and clay. So we need we definitely need clay in here. So we're going to need to grab that. I'm going to put this back over here and dump the clay in. And as soon as we can make nails, we're going to make some nails. And then we're going to use our wood and we're going to make some storage boxes. There's, there's, a set, there's a couple of types of storage boxes. The writable storage box, that's the main thing that we want. All right, how many nails can we make now? 25 nails. We don't need that many, but hey, we've made 25 nails. Meanwhile, uh, hmm, let me think. I should probably make some regular water. Oh, boil some eggs, definitely. And boil some water. It's going to take about 40 seconds. Got to remember not to run because I have a splint on. Good. All right. We are still doing that. Okay. So now we can make some writable storage chests. So we're going to make one, two, three of those. Oh, I can't make three because I don't have enough nails yet. All right. need five more nails. And one more storage box. Brilliant. Okay. I repair. Uh, can't repair that because I don't have a stone. Ugh. All right. What a hard life I lead. Do I have any stone here? I don't see any stone. Do I have any stone here? I don't see any stone. Ooh, there's more clay here though. We can uh, we can put that clay in. Like that brass went by really quickly, but all right. Okay. Let's put one storage here, one storage there, and one storage. No! Damn it. Didn't want it right there. That's a dumb place to put it. That's okay. We're going to edit this. We're going to call this food water. I'm going to edit this one and call this one ammo. No, no, that's not going to be the ammo. This is going to be ingredients. We'll make this one ammo for right now. It's in a dumbass spot. Why not? All right, what do we got? Oh, I need one more for seeds and stuff, but that's okay. We'll deal with that. Oh, I need medical. Hmm, I want my put my I'll put my medical up there. Uh, come on, let's make some more nails. I don't need that many. I need like 30 nails. Now I can go back down. Get my food out of here. Food my water. Turn that off. Eat the food. We're good.
All right, there's our nails, and then we're going to need to make three more boxes. Now, we have a bit of a light. We have a light source here, and that says dead. That's great. Uh, we don't have light here. Do I have a torch? Oh, my! is my torch downstairs? I don't know. Do I have animal fat? Mmm, doesn't appear to. Doesn't appear that I do. Oh, there's my torch. Okay. Here's what we're going to do. Oh, no. I want to keep my beer on hand at all times. All right, we're going to put this right here for now. There we go. And we're going to rename you to Medical. There we go. That's what we want. All right, so let's go ahead and grab everything here that we want to keep uh, in that box. Okay, steroids, bites, all that stuff, that stuff. That's also medical. That should do for now. There we go. And I'll put the bandages. What do we got for ingredients? Chrysanthemum. I'll put the rotting flesh there right now. That's for farm for making farm plots, but we better not be eating any of that. That that is a rough time if we have to eat that. Blueberries are here. The jar of honey. Honey is actually medical, so we're gonna put might have put that up there. We're gonna put these ingredients away, and then food and water. I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of my red tea. I'll put the glass in there. Is there any other food? I don't see any other food right now. Fair enough. And definitely no food here. All right. So we have medical ingredients, food and water, and ammunition is up here. Do we have any ammo to put away? Ammo, ammo, ammo. Yes. Okay. Ammo, ammo, ammo. Hey, it's morning. Look at that. Uh, all right. So ammunition. Let's do... Uh, ranged weapons here, maybe. And melee weapons down here. Okay. Melee weapon. And we're going to do the mods here as well for right now, although down the road I'll probably end up um, separating them out. All right, that's that. That's a four grip. That's going to be firing for weapons. That I think is for melee weapons. I'm just I'll put it there for now. That's also for melee, and that's for ranged. Okay, ranged, ranged. Good. And then bone knife and the bow and all that jazz. We're in good shape there. I do need to make a seed box at some point, but not just yet. That's machete parts, and that's metal chain mod. Rocket launcher parts. So rocket launcher parts will go there. These go into melee. Let's go ahead and take everything out of here. And then put it back in here. And then I will destroy this. Ah, oh, dang it. Right, I'm going to punch it the rest of the way. There we go. Oh, come on. All right, well, forgot that it took an extra run. So we'll go ahead and go out here, and we need to go get some, get some stone right over there. Run very, very little bit here. Oh crap, that's right, I'm out of stone. So I need to go find a, a single stone to fix my stone axe. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Oh, looks like there's one right over there. Just gotta be very careful about running. There we go, that's fixed. Let's head over here and actually do some stone mining. What else do I want to put? The, I'll put these here as well, yeah. Or 
forgot I had this. Oh, and I do have a skill point I haven't spent yet, so I gotta remember to deal with that. Uh, let's go over back. Let's go back home. Let's go up here. All right, now we can now we can get rid of this chest. We just don't we just don't need it. We also don't need the other one, but we still have to put down some more boxes first. So, what do we got? Let's put that in there. We got a little bit of iron. So now what I want to do is I actually want to make an iron, an iron door, which is going to take 10 forged iron, and then I can put an iron door right there. So let's see... How much forge iron can I make? 36. So we just make the 10 that I need right now. What do we have in here? Alright, so I need, need a, definitely need a seed box and I need some other things. I'll put, I'll put some other boxes up along here. Let's get some nails. Let's get another 30 nails. While that's cooking, Let's go back out. Now what I really want to find is a good ore spot. Now on the map here you're going to see these are big boulders and these are little rocks, uh, uh, little little, little uh, spots that we can mine like right here. So let's see. Oh no, I guess the no, I guess they changed it. The gray dots are are, uh, are trees now. The little black dots, those are I think mining spots now. They changed it around very recently in the most recent alphas, I think. Oh god, I gotta stop I gotta remember to stop running. Yeah, it's a tree. Alright, so we're gonna go we're gonna go find something to dig out. This is all Boulder Town. I don't want bolt. Ooh, we got something there? Yes. Some feathers. Okay. I need to find something other than a stone boulder. Oh, good. We got some glue. What I really need to find is an iron deposit. There's a there's a zombie. All right. All right. All right. Let's brawl the fuck out of you, dude. Gotcha. All right. There's gotta be something around here somewhere. God, I wish I could run right now. What am I looking for? Oh, back here. Back here. That's what I need. I need to turn 180 degrees. Ooh, good job for me. Oh, God. It's got to stop running. I can see my foot throbbing over there. All right, nearly there. Yeah, these spots. There it is, there it is, there it is. That's an iron, that's an iron deposit, that's exactly what I want. So now what I'm gonna do, since this is the closest one I've found, I think this is the closest one to the house, to the house. So I'm gonna, well, these these here. I'm gonna go ahead and mark this just so I don't lose it. 
I'm going to call this one iron. Boom. Now it's now it'll always be on my map. I mean, it's obviously it's there on the on the map with the little red dot, but it's hard to hard to see those. And it says, "Looks like there's more ore below." Sure, sure enough, there it is. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and drink some coffee. I'm gonna drop the plant fibers. Drink some coffee to make my stamina boost. You can see here, stamina regen 20% for three minutes. That's a dumb place to have dropped those pl those plant fibers. I'm just to collect those and put them somewhere else later. So now you can see on the left side there the little status icons. I've got about three minutes on. I got three minutes on the coffee, and so that's just saying that for the next three minutes I get a 20% stamina boost, uh, stamina regen boost. Which you can see that means I can actually just sit here whacking away without really dropping my stamina so much that I can't keep going. Eventually it'll drop all the way down, but then I can just... Oh, shit! Fuck! Oh, that's rough. Okay, I need to get my bone shiv here. Cut him up. You want to use a bladed weapon against these so you can get the most resources possible. And there are perks to get even more. This will get me meat, which I'll definitely be cooking soon. And we'll go back to this. Oh, but wow, look at my health level. I'm going to go ahead and take one of these bandages. Oh, and there's uh, there's some animal fat, which we'll be able to use for making more, uh, making more um, torches. I'm going to need forged iron to repair this. You can see here it says repair with a... Oh, no, I need a repair kit. That's right. Repairs with a repair kit. It used to be forged iron. I don't need to worry about that. Uh, go back to my thing here. So, yeah, we'll need we'll need a repair kit. We have a, a couple of them, I think. Um, but I'll, I'll need... I won't be able to uh, dig out of this forever. We'll get a chunk of iron, though. That'll help us out a lot. And we can already make repair kits. They're not that hard to make. They just require resources that I don't know that I have in abundance at the moment. Yeah. I'm basically done, but I'm going to go ahead now and dig here. Oh, shit. That was not intentional. I did not mean to fall into a hole. But we are getting clay, which is good. It's also, you know, shoveling doesn't take as much stamina as the other options, uh, as the other types of mining, and the, but you do get pretty decent experience. So it's a worthwhile um, thing to just, like, shovel out there. If you got nothing else to do, if you're waiting for daylight or something, just go out and shovel. You'll get decent XP. Especially if you got a cup of coffee. You can see my stamina... It's pretty much just staying stable. In fact, it looks like it's going up. It's maxing out. So, yeah. And even with even with my uh, coffee no longer working, you can see the coffee is gone. Even so, look, it's not eating up a lot of stamina to shovel. But look at how much XP I'm getting. Oh, well, of course I need to repair that. I'm still getting a decent amount of XP from that. There we go. Okay. So our, we know our mine is down here, so we're going to go back to the house. Looks like I can I can run more reliably with the splint than I thought I could. That's good to know. 
I know that if you have a broken leg or a broken arm and you don't splint it, or no, a sprained leg and you don't sp splint it, you can actually end up with a break. So that, that would suck. All right, let's go here. And we're gonna go ahead and put the iron in, divide that, grab these, make some more, make an iron door. That's gonna take a minute and 40. And we're gonna make some more storage. Make three of those. But while we're waiting for that, oh, my repair kits. I've got two repair kits, so I'm gonna go ahead and repair that. Oh, I should do that first, actually. And I'll do my boxes first, because they'll take less time. You can always cancel a, a build in progress, and you will get all of the materials back. As long as it hasn't finished building, you will get the materials back. All right, so... There's the repair kit. That, okay, so my, my iron pickaxe is done. And, you know, the other thing I can do is I should probably make some more forged iron because I want to make a, uh, a fire axe. So let's make as much of that as I can. All right. Am I good all here? Yeah, so I'm going to make an armor box right here. Oh, did not mean to do that. All right. Oh, let's do this. Armor. And that's going to be the hat. It's going to be that. It's going to be the armor parts. All right. And we're going to put that there, that there, that there. Oh, I've got some ammo here that I don't need right now. Put that in there. We've got armor. Parts. What else do we need? We're gonna have. I'm gonna want to have like a textiles, but I kind of want to put it right here. So, ah, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna make another box over here. We're gonna make a box. Put it up a little high, just so it's not like goofily sitting on top of the forge. We're gonna call that one stone, sand, clay. We do one here, and we're going to call that one metals. So I'm going to put the cobblestone in there as well, and the cement, because that's that's kind of all. It's all of a piece, right? Put my stones in there, and metals. Oh, you know what? I do want one more box to put wood in. So we just need ten more nails. That off, get more forged iron, there we go. All right, now, uh, one more storage box. Oh, and we did get the iron door, so that's nice. So I'm gonna put wood right here. And that will be, I and mean, then we just do textiles, and, and there'll be a few others. There's gonna be seeds and things like that, but these are the big ones, really. I'm gonna do wood. Yeah, I should probably make a seed box. Probably like right around here. All right, so coal is gonna go with wood because that is kind of what it is. The jars are gonna go with food. Let's see. Gunpowder is gonna go with ammunition. Where did I put it? Oh, 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 and the meat. That's gonna go there. That's, ugh, that doesn't really go there, but we're gonna put it there anyway. We're gonna put the animal fat there too. What else we got? Lead. Goes the metals. The clay is gonna go here. I'm gonna put about half of the wood here just so we have half of the wood there. How are we doing here? We got a whole bunch of forged iron. Now, if I want to do an axe, iron fire axe, we need some wood, leather. Oh, we just need three duct tapes. Do I have any duct tapes? I've got six. Okay, let's make an iron fire axe. Bingo. All right, perfect. Let's put that back. 
forged iron and forged steel. Those are going to go in metals. And then down here, reinforcing it. There we go. Now we have an iron door. It's going to be a little bit stronger. So we're coming along. I'll get the sham sandwich, put you in ingredients. Yeah, for, for now, oh, there's lead. Cotton, I don't want to do, I definitely want to do seeds and things later. All right, what do we got in here now? All right, we are still working our way through that. That's fine. Do we need water? We do need to eat something. All right, let's see what we can do. I probably should have put put should have put a an ingredients and food thing down by the actual campfire, but whatever. All right, let's go down here. I can make boiled meat, charred meat, or grilled meat, and that's really just because. Okay, so we got boiled meat needs the pot. Charred meat doesn't need anything, and grilled meat needs the cooking grill. If you have neither pot nor grill, you can do charred meat, but it doesn't get you as much. So boiled meat takes raw meat and water. Charred meat just takes meat. Grilled meat just takes meat. And they do, they have different values in terms of capability of, uh, of uh, food intake, but oh god. There's somebody out there. He's right outside. Let's go get him before we uh, we end this up. Brawler build. Oh, wow. Mini horde. Mini horde. Screw this. Oh, I got hit once. All right. Well, so there's that 5%, that plus 5% killer instinct. Gain 5% for each kill up to 15%. That was nice. I like that. Still one more? Where'd you go? There you are. All right. There's another one out there, but we're not gonna worry about him right now. Okay, so let's do some grilled meat. Let's do one grilled meat and one boiled meat. You can see here, grilled meat takes less time than boiled meat. But we'll take a look and see what the values are in terms of the, the health value. Boiled meat requires water. Grilled meat does not. And then after we've done that, I will go ahead and close out the episode. Except there is still one more dude out here. Come on. Yep, and there's my 5%. See, yeah, that's the brawler build is cool. It's it's fun. I, I've never done it before, like I said, uh, but it's uh, it, I'm really enjoying it. Got to remember to uh, keep, my, keep my punching on. Okay. Done. Turn that off. Now let's take a look. 10 food, 5 health, max stamina bonus for the grilled. The boiled meat gives me additional health... And, and it gives me water as well. So the boiled water is val more valuable. It's better than the grilled. But you do it does require water. So I'm going to go ahead and eat that. 
Then I'm go ahead and eat that. And just in time for that to drop. So we've got an airdrop coming right down there, which we'll catch next time. I have it set to happen every three days. And I, but I do also have it set to show it on the map, which doesn't necessarily do. But if you want to take a look and see what that looks like out there, maybe we can see it. Oh, fuck. Look at me being dumb. There it is. It's coming down. I need to heal myself up here. Wow, that was stupid. We still have 15 meats, so okay. But there it goes. So next time, we will go ahead and uh, collect that. So yeah, thanks for watching. See you next time.